financially, guys. <laughs> Yes, you can support your brother financially to start something for his own. In fact, if, if I can support my sister financially, why can't That's a sister. We are not talking about siblings. We are talking. We are talking. A boy child is a boy child. Is a, child. a brother is a brother. We are all sister, children of sister. Adam, so we are brother. Oh hello guys, how are you? Hope you've been fine. My good name is Susan Mweni and today I have very 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 special guest. But before that, guys, me I will always to share you. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. To our new subscribers, thank you so much. To the returning subscribers, we love you. And today our topic is going to be very interesting by the way. But before I introduce the topic, I would like to have the guest Dr. Patia at least a clue of what you're going to discuss. So let's meet our guest after this break. Welcome back. We're discussing more about the boy child and today we are going to cover more about the issue that are affecting the boy child and how what can be the next move that can help us rescue the boy child because you have seen a lot of things happen around the youth especially the guy child and uh, we are wondering is there a voice of somebody who is going to stand up and speak on behalf of the boy child so with my brother and sister over here today in the studio we're going to do it a little different and we are going to talk all more about the same so welcome guys to the studio today thank you, thank you. Yeah, so maybe there's somebody who is wondering who are these are. You no, know, you might be famous. But there's somebody who is new who wants to understand who you are and uh, who you are and what you do. So with that time, you can introduce yourself and let the viewer know who you are and what you do. Okay. Thank you, guys. Whatever you're watching us, my name is Emmanuel, aka God with us. Mm. You're here. And we are sharing the word of God and we are encouraging somebody outside there so that you can see what you can do to the boy child because mm -hmm. boy child is going through much 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 and they are still silent mm -hmm. so stay tuned and those who are outside there please subscribe share to your friends invite them to follow this channel follow this channel yeah and therefore we welcome the professional professional uh boy child fighter <laughs> <laughs> Uh -huh. <laughs> so hi guys <laughs> my name is Susan or you can call me Miso and we are here so today it's all about good vibes and listening to the boy child Naskia wa nalia sana just going to, to focus on, on the facts you're going also to be here to represent the girl child I to so if you can play with the boy child you have the voice uh, me i'm here for the stories yeah. all right all of us are being represented here uh, i think it's gonna do that gender equality about the studio so, <laughs> so we, are not, we are not off we are not off peak so so stay tuned stay put and let's continue the discussion yeah so my guys my guys yeah, yeah, sana. and uh now the topic that the reason why we came up with this topic is because uh there's a, a video that has been trending online uh, of uh guys different guys being asked in your lowest moment who do you go to and all of them were answering nobody uh i'm a man nobody cares so in in line to that because you've, you've never seen like organization of people coming up to fight for a boy child it's always about the girl child which we have uh, it happens like that or is it that because the girl child is uh is much like today it feels like they are much overprotected than the boy child so i'm going to to understand is there need for an adjustment mm -hmm. so that a boy child can also feel like they belong somewhere because yeah. some of them are nowadays feel like they are just useless. Nobody cares. Nobody listens. Nobody helps. And uh, you can find that majority of suicides are happening is because there is no person lending an ear. And uh, from kiwa toto boy child na ambiwa, you have to suppress that kauchungu. Hey, kufa na kufa kimwanaume. So that's what you're going to cover today. What do you think has been the biggest problem in the long run about boy child? 
Okay, my first point will be I think ninyenye amjaji toa kuongea enough because this is the smallest things by the way mtatupata kwa street. Ladies. The smallest things mtatupata to kwa street. Mandawan. Exactly because <laughs> <laughs> we've been taught to express ourselves. So that I think up to this generation it's up to the guys. Mm-hmm. Kwa first to your your channel ni hizo nini za kina baba zenyu and all the rest. Kwa kuambia wewe machozi ya manoma ife kuonekana. Ndume ni ndume. Ndume ni ndume na unakufa ndani ndani. Speak out and maybe something might happen. So wasema the best thing that ladies does is kwenda maandamano. I'm not saying that should be. <laughs> I'm not saying in the protocol my faith for what but mki mki voice out your grievances frequently. I think someone might give a will be hard yeah what, what's your view emmanuel ladies they know how to talk they know how to speak mm. ladies they know how to make a that was to be hard vocal and they still have uh, people who are above them mm. who are still supporting them to do that mm-hmm. so now i think now we as a boy child uh-huh. we need <laughs> to have that to raise our voices that they are voices and uh, which now you know men they are men and they have that mentality of they are men, are men. Are, so you mean that if they feel that it's not it's i'll be like a woman mm. and i don't want to be like a woman mm. of which it is not healthy mm-hmm. so even if they don't be even if boy child does not just speak out loud uh. they should have a channel in a way of presenting their issues a platform exactly. for people exactly. now assuming your scenario susan i'll say my slightest thing They are on the street, eh? Mandamano. Assuming Wanauma ko Mandamano na. It's only men Mandamano. How would that look? Sounds weird though. Ndo ko mnanguru matu ko kwa street. One thing that one thing that motivate Mandamano is seeking for protection and seeking for validation, eh? Now imagine Wanauma matoka. Now they are the people who should be protecting the community. Now ko Mandamano. Who will listen? So that me, your mentality ndio unafanya mnarudi nyuma by the way. Yeah. There is this not this notion that uh, men who are part of commandamano and commandamano in the politics it come as the male host to na shobawe ruto masiko nini o masiko o the indigenous must be preached sijui nini nini utapata kutoka kwa kama sile so now i think now on uh, the same mm-hmm. way they have the the voice out to do things of that uh-huh. they should also be able to voice out mm-hmm. on the issues of their inner issues uh-huh. which they go every day but unakuja una, una ku notice one thing huh? I think I think uh, the society has formed that gap because to crazy what una unaambiwa we, we survive alone and uh, even the family you find that a good example for me being uh, the guy in my family they go around ladies huh? and uh, I could not even speak to them like your relationship because on call kwa mbuta kama na umemdaku wala so wezi <laughs> wezi pick a story now all through scan on wake sana utakuwa mtu wa Mm-hmm. So when I feel your moment like you're being pushed away. Yeah. And today I feel like uh, you know, when you look at the lady side la mesema they on the street. Yeah. And you know the difference is when waka kwa sauti. Yeah. If a woman scream right here kila mbona atoka. But if a man screams or atakuja kushinda kwa ni shida wewe mwanaume ni nini? My friend hata ukiongea kwa matatu. Unaona watu wameingia na kufaiti hata kama kwa kwa hiyo watu wote kiingilia bayo na ngina madam haji. Mhm. Unaona? Yaani yaani wako na ile confidence yako na protection. Protection is all around. So okay, lakini mwanaume akisema akipiga kipiga duru pale hivyo, anambia wewe bana utakushukisha, utakwenda chini, wewe ni nyamaza. Kwa mwanaume. Kwa mwanamke. So now that I'm me complain me complain me complain <laughs> what do you want us to do way, what do you want to just say dia just to say dia just to think about when or what can now you like you like yeah. okay what i think according to my mhm view what i think mm. my view is man let's talk about the way they right from child mhm right from when they are young if they want to speak out they can only speak out mm. starting from the word go mm. so if a man cannot if a boy child a boy a child when he's young cannot be able to give, cannot be given that opportunity ya kuongea express hata akikuwa mkubwa akitamani mm. mm. so now is to you to nafaa kwanza wapi pale chini hata ukisikia hata even even if today mtoto mwenye mtoto mtoto mzazi mwenye kwa mtoto msichana na mwenye kwa kijana utapata issues za msichana kwa mdogo na shughuli kwa haraka very fast very fast lakini ya mwanaume 
So do you think okay, so. do you think this one is brought about by parenting? Or the, the first course ni parenting. It's I think that is whether to, whether, whether to stay opposition leader. Okay. <laughs> no, I was not opposing. I was oh, trying okay. to, I was I wanted to ask Manu so what you're trying to say is that tunafaa kwanza ku empower wakiwa chini as they grow. Because I, I think uh, on this perspective. Mm. We mtoi like me ni nimekuresha kwa ikwa mdogo mimi nilikuwa naongeana when i was in school i was i used to preach mm. in school so walimu walikuwa wanajanga ah man the preacher man anajua kuhubiri eh kuja tuombe kuja so that can give me the courage mm-hmm. even up to today even wherever i am if i see somebody that is not working well i and speak out na sasa kwambia what i do at the at last if kama nimekukosea tafadhali nisame mm. but my voice in ski is ski now assume that we want to and go you as we are going Mm-hmm. How do you expect at 20 at 20 some years as a kujifunza kwa mwanga now to stand before people and you know ah this one is wrong how oh, i need this one this one ni lazima tu angaliwe hapana ila wanakufa tu atasema fanya mkifanya sawa msipofanya sawa so the next thing ni i'd have to make some we are really this reaction sir yeah so anyway so yeah, yeah. parenting is is the first thing because uh, at the early stages of growth hapo ndo pale mtoto anajua the weakness the strength and if people are giving me attention or not so i think i think that's a good point coming across what was the next level do you think that this suppression not okay so sir me I'll ask should this empowerment come from women or your fellow men the, the problem what i think is happening today is a uh, is a uh, man eat man society which means the people whom boy child is looking towards to to be supporting figure are not giving the ear to this man they are uh, they are dealing cause unajua when a woman is somewhere in between and men are there we always try to together cv yeah we try to make cv good. so <laughs> so you find that the boy child is, does not have somebody to talk a good example like uh, ukiangalia kwa government structure we have so many bodies that are protecting women and ladies and when you, when you come to wanaume there is nobody that there is nobody in the government structure that protects a boy child apart Kwa from the court wanataka tuatafutie men rep vile maana wamesema wanataka men rep kwa na men representative nafika pale they air out the issue and then we find the solution that comes comes with it because i think if there's a place where a boy child is being fought for we can have a, a secure community because you understand that we suppress something inside it will automatically burst yeah. yeah and because we are suppressing so much and that's why you find that when we when boy child is suppressing so much in their heart they're always looking for a way to release that anger and the problem is whenever somebody is angry they look for the weaker person hata kwa group mm. when some when somebody is angry even the lion they always look for the for the weakest weakest, weakest animal ndo wanakimbi wanakimbiza so it's is the same thing so i think those bodies should be there that at least they're trying not just fighting totally for the boy child but trying to protect the boy child from all these things akish dani people who are killing the boy child are the men themselves exactly so we are not the problem guys so, okay. we need to come up helping mm. boy child because if this person does not does not get that platform mm. like women mm. they just want to maybe on a drawing and a picture at least they are going to be but what I can see I like that attack you just come at what you must say and I believe what I'm saying voko luko ah what I'm saying and I'm saying I'm saying I do at me means not just party and totos na anything na cards na anything na anything me I think now I don't find what you total we we would like to like na happy no gonna come and mcheza mcheza that is to get your manager to na unajua kwa sababu yeye ndiye is working for the government ama yeye ndiye ni leader atakuwa ndiye conversion ya mtoto hii considerate liwa si apeleko wapi ya iwe wapi 1 2 3 1 2 lakini mwanaume sasa mwanaume ako na issue ya kwake yenye anahitaji help but i i do where i'm as i am 
ajui ni nani anaweza kuonyesha mm. because ajui alishiambia huyu atanichukuliaje because most of the responses that men they get when they go to us maybe for some help also but I go with mana over ba you need to figure out it is gani eh you know imagine you mtu akikuliza aje okay so far what have you thought to do mm alafu anakwambia my friend you need to sit down plan yourself see the way you can do things out na wewe mtu akona kichingine atakwambia hakuna kichingine lakini mwanamke akifika ataulizwa kwa nani anarambia bi style sauti ina change kwanza ah the well the well coming ah, change i think you, you have faced <laughs> the wrong people now <laughs> how can we help you <laughs> eh hey, buda ah tunasaidia aje hapo kuna kisa kinaweza kuwa tuna tunaenda unajua eh alija kienda kwa mwanamke kuna vile atatritiwa mm. ama sasa sisi tuanze kwenda kwa ladies leo waanze kutu uh, na ukienda hivi unakuja you, you think wiki. do you think that one will work <laughs> na ukienda pale utaweka kama wiki best one ala tu sio kwa no na ninyi ndo mko na issue from ladies perspective <laughs> Number one, it's very hard kusikia mwanume ati oh I went to see a therapist. Hamtakangi kiburi haiwakubali hata kidogo. Ukweli? The problem is the 90% ya ya therapists are women. They are there to help you. But the the rule that is stupid the rule of men say you that only, is stupid. You, only, you only share your problem with men. No that's what killing it is killing you guys. Like I'm gonna sijui ni kiburi ama it's the way me grow. Man man from the beginning is created with an ego that needs to be protected and a man does not go being vulnerable. What if what if only a woman can help you protect that ego? Then that ego cannot be protected by a woman. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> that, that that's something that has been there for long. Who knows? That's something that has been It's there a new generation long. by the way the mentality here hapa. Okay, by the way the more you keep growing those mentalities, mnazipeleka kwa the coming generation mm. and if what ndo kutakuwa all through. The issue has been so much of disappointment. As quite a lot of guys maybe wamekuja wame share issue with another friend of theirs or brother or sister but it's being taken lightly like it's not So what 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 causes men to coil back to that corner is because I shared but nobody listened. And you find that some some suicide notes that are written by this guy who take their life is I tried and I tried but I could not find help. Everybody I talked to was not willing to help. Sometimes we can say the boy child is not vocal but we are vocal but not take you like this ah uh, oh my god that too not vocal enough by the way even after you end up working then you go anywhere you go in the working station as long as una pambana hata kama utakufa hakuna mimi anakuja lakini alende akuja hapa hivyo tutakia oh eh, please help this lady to lift this and take it somewhere but yeah but I'm, no 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 this should not be no we can share so you find that now in one moment like you know hivyo when it happens like that now what next what do you expect next mm-hmm. so it a quite like even in that uh, in the, in, the, in that uh, company or in that uh, area of work or in that uh, at that moment you mtu atakuwa na skill eh the the hard things they have for me the soft things they have for ladies so hiyo mtu akikaa hivi atakama kufa ndani yake do you think that person will be able to go and speak uh, to help their problems maybe to their superiors because and the superior is the one whom you should share the information and is the one who is telling you to do that Mm. Do you think that you get any help? I think because these are things that are right now. We need to have some sort of structure. Mm-hmm. At least so that somebody is outside there because I'm very sure that there are so many people who are grieved in their hearts, who are heartbroken, who they don't know what to do. Mm. They don't know where to go. Mm. They don't know who to approach. Mm. And they have problem. And they are looking where they can get some help. Mm. Uh, in in in, in a a better way let's take it to susan you know assuming it's your brother now in this picture okay he's not vocal and you can clearly see that this person even though he's trying to smile because that's what we are trained to do appear like you don't have a problem though you have a problem and you'll find that there are a video that was done when people brothers and sisters are giving each other surprise hug 
and uh, you find that they were crying literally the brother could cry because do we only we only see hugs when we are with our boyfriend and girlfriends but we've never seen that hug that tells you i'm here for you you are my brother you are my sister i love you it's never there so i think after a boy has been has undergone this system of circumcision and now he's grown from school he's now free that love you have to buy it now so what, what, why do you think this happens is it because one kijana amekuwa kijana sasa ajitafute is that how it should be? No, that's not how it should be. It goes down to what you just said about parenting. Maybe at a mama be the even mothers mm. like But pia some boys it gets to a stage like unapata the mother is comfortable like if it's communication it's time for communication I ask you how you feel mm. how was your day and mm. all that. But there is a certain age at Africa like teenager ata kumpatia a kiss on the forehead like mom i'm a grown up boy mm. usijaribu kunikiss mbele ya marafiki zangu bali ya marafiki ndio mbaya <laughs> <laughs> behind the scene is okay ata behind the scene na like mom no and that's why you'll find that if if you call your boyfriend and and at the end of conversation mom i love you when we have, we have our friend we can never reply back i love you too why because it's something weird before guys <laughs> You find somebody struggling like I love you too. <laughs> <laughs> All through you are communicating mm-hmm. there was no noise. It was loud loud clear voice. Yeah. But when it comes to I love you too the voice yeah, goes down. Why? <laughs> Because it's something it weird. It's, it's 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 there. There are behavior there are rules of men that you you don't cross like. So the only people that can bring up the rule of man and help man become man is man. So what I think the solution here which you are looking for is these people who are ahead of us. These men who are ahead of us are the one to now take the further step of trying to protect the younger men not to be silent but to be vocal. But when when these young guys are being shut down like a younger brother of mine will come and tell me This is what is disturbing me. And then I'm be eh hey, when ni kijana bana you are a man try find your own way. I've shut that. Then he will always have a replay of I'm a man I have to sort my own issues. But if these people who are ahead of us from not fa- just family but even the leadership political level are airing voices out of how we can help men not just kutafutia kazi ya mtaani. That's not only way to, to help a boy child. Mm-hmm. but creating forums creating organization and workshops where guys will come and just talk another thing is also the church leadership because that's where men go mostly when when a man is at the level of end of it and indulge but anga kwa nikisa obvious because he goes back to the loving hands of his father god and the worst thing is it's hard to understand if a man is troubled because they don't cry Yeah, a man even will never cry, cry. Hey, and if you see a man cry is eight two things involved i'm a fika mwisho i'm a match on a girlfriend but it's always good to cry good to cry because of that love the experience of god so there are there are those that expression but that is not common have you have you realized one thing that a man who is able to cry in a situation utapata ni mwanaume mmoja amelelewa na wazazi mpaka ikafika mahali anakuwa because of in case of anything just come to us mm. we are giving opportunities i'm here for you yes and then yeah. there is you mwenye ujapata you will be like unalia mbele ya watu kwa nini wake up mama okay so i think on the same men we need a uh, boy child needs to be given an environment whereby the they are given the opportunities to express themselves now kuna wale wanapata na baby mzazi na kuna wanapata kitu so wanafanya nini wewe wewe mchingo mchinga ni nani hii uchinga ni nani so in in by the way in wewe mtu alikuwa anafanya hiyo kitu badala ya kumwonja kumwita vizuri kumwonyesha 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 vizuri sasa kuna msafisha na okay kuna nikifanya kitu hivi ni nini inaweza kuwa nikifanya kitu kingine kufanya makosa so is fearing even to speak out when when it makosa 
So I think this man, this, this boy child should be given an environment by the parents in a way that despite of what they go through, they can be able to sit down either with the mother and the father mm. or to the father to mm. share anything. And the parents can give them a hearing ear mm. and they support them so that they can make them to be men who they want them to be. Because you cannot make a man to be a man by just shouting. No. But you can make a man to be a man through word of words. Mm. So when you have an opportunity in the case of this village, at least now that you I can go to dad, I can go to my, my pastor, I can go to an elder plan in mm. the church, and I can share my issue. So my plans and my problems will be discussed and they will give me a solution to that. Now this is somebody when you, even from the court, from the church, I can only opportunity and courage. Parents, please, take time with your boys, take time with your children, create forums, take them, at least to take them out. Now, my daughter, get into the car, let's go. Eh? It is not bad. But men, they still need to feel like that. Mm. Eh? Belong. Listen to them. Give them that year. Give them, give them opportunity to lay out their points. Mm. These people, they have uh, suggestions, yeah. but if you don't take their suggestions, I can give you an, uh, an open opinion, which is not one of the best. Mm. But the way you, you respond it, you receive it, it will give me another way to air out another point. So in an in an grow. Mm. You cannot you don't expect me to grow at least they make mistakes. Through the mistakes, now you rectify that you correct the mistakes, then you make that person to be strong. And you to tell them that I give you what is them to speak. Okay. In case of anything, it's able to communicate. Because they have been given that environment. Mm. But now, how many do have that opportunity? So, I are uh, urging parents outside there. We are urging everyone in leadership outside there. Let's give this boy child opportunity and a good environment mm. to speak out. Let's support them. So, Ruth of Pia Tengah is a Linda boy child ah. movement. Eh. <laughs> Apart oh. from Linda Mama, when I unless Mwanza and we force through, no, you'll yeah, wait. Linda, Linda boy child. I couldn't get to my grandma. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yes, we, we, we are not advocating for anti something about my misogynistic or women hates, but we are trying to see that where we can create a conducive environment where every child is uh, is uh, appreciated, is loved and is uh, cared for. And this will be by us guys who are ahead, knowing the problem with what is happening. We should take step to now go back and pull those young guys to be expressional, to be audible of what's going on in their life. Because we might be living with people, but we are, uh, you know, today people are normal or may change. I don't know. I'm a lady side to favor as other to change genders. I was like, oh, men are becoming women. Mm? You think that is just uh, what is happening, LGBTQ thing. But they are saying, if I go this other side and say I'm a, I'm a woman, I find, more, much more I find more protection than when I remain to be uh-huh. a man. So we don't want to lose men in this generation. We want to build men. And building men will be through speaking out things that are affecting them. So if it's in church, I think the leadership in church will build opportunities for young guys like youths, even just have a guys men sex, section for guys to meet us guys and they share their problem because men have like the same problem but in different capacities mm-hmm. so if if i pour out my problem now that person will pick it and say i was there last year and this is what happened and this is how i overcame it and another one will pick it from there and bring a change and if, if we look at the government structure also the government should look at the well-being of a boy child because what we can see in the media all through we can in a week you can see the girl child uh the gender equality stuff and then when when it's like the government is seeing like women are very weak and you're trying to lift them to become like men which is not the case 
we have equal capacity capability and it's all about us now working together and because of this you find that the women empowerment group is so big than boy child empowerment so guys are giving up and women are coming up today if you stand kwa barabara and look at the road how many women are driving their car so many, yeah. so many because there are people who are empowering them to become better yeah. but when you look at the boy child ameacho ajitafutie ajitafutie njia yake whatever whatever guy ladies are working hard and because there are people who are empowering them guys women are up there telling them go girl go girl you can do this you deserve this you deserve a better life but who is telling a boy child that you can do this you deserve a better life the only thing you are told is you are a failure you are going to lose if you so we are, we are left at that point of second guessing ourselves am i good enough and and you know when once a, an ego of a guy a boy child is bruised you've lost that guy yeah yeah restoring that guy ata kama alikuwa mdogo it will be difficult because they always see themselves as worthless so i think people who have known this people who are in power and even above should consider how to bring up these young guys wow from mwalimu Sunday school mwalimu primary to the president wow not only just like let's learn from women they've been learning from us but still now we learn from them let's empower our own let's build men empowerment segment in in various places to bring men to the best position to sure. restore the man wow. i think that that's my take in solution Suzanne, your take mm-hmm. so before we close out this video I'll just like to urge my fellow women ladies girls come on a kazi na ponje mwanume at least call him or her or Find call him out. not her Find out. call him ask him how was his day kama kwa hapo karibu mkalishe cheni muulize maisha inampeleka aje kama inamtandika at least find someone who's better than him mm-hmm. i'm say dear your brothers maybe even your fathers at this point mtu wa 18 years and is a say dear baba can see it's true mm-hmm. yeah so just Check on these men they are going through a lot too. I've had them. We we bought her. She needs <laughs> I've had needs, them. I've had them. Needs, they need needs, help. Na wao wame the ego. Wame the hiyo ego. We just we come through for them. She needs protection. So guys, you are not in this. We are so happy to have you around. We are so pleased to have you guys. The Lord bless you so much. Who stop been watching? Where you have been watching us? Please subscribe. Please share to your friends. Like and don't forget to drop your comment. And as we finalize, we say that men they need to be heard. Therefore, let's create this environment to be conducive for us as boy child to be heard. Parents, please take care of boy child. Remember. Mm-hmm. Father, son, you can you make your son to be like you. If you have voice, if you have voice, make your son to be to have that voice. Women and our sisters outside there, hey, you are the best in the key to support this man. Please check on them. Listen to them. If it's your brother, please support them in any way. Support them financially, materially. Remember, it's your blood. And the Bible says what in Isaiah. Hmm. Financially. Tell us, tell us, tell us. Financially. Financially. <laughs> we will draw protection from you if you... <laughs> financially, guys. <laughs> yes, you can support your brother financially exactly. to start something for his own. In fact, if, if I can support my sister financially... Why That's a sister, we are not talking about siblings. We are talking, we are talking, a boy child is a boy child. Is a a brother is a brother. We are all sister, children sister, of sister. Adam, so we are brothers and sisters. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> guys, <laughs> we'll see you on the next video. Until then, yeah. adios muchachos. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs>